thumbnail. Jala, let's do a thumbnail. <laughs> That's cool. I never thought of that before. Okay, ready? Yeah. Welcome. Oh, you... <laughs> One, two, three. Welcome, Welcome back, back to the life of a Fifo family. family. Right now, Jyla and I are, what are we doing? Doing the coco. Mm -hmm. So we are taking, I don't even know what these things are called. Are they called beans or? Yeah, I think they're cocoa beans. Cocoa beans. Yeah. Coco beans. So we're taking it out. Um, this is the first time we're doing this on our own. So the boys are on their way to us or S's house, my niece, so that she can come and help us cook it. But we thought we'll get a head start so that when she gets here, we've already taken all the coco beans out. If it if it's not called coco beans, somebody correct me in the comments, please. <laughs> but yeah, it's this is cool. I love, 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 love coco. Do you love coco? Love it. Love it. You just don't realize though how much work goes into making it. Hey, yeah. um, I know there was a comment on my TikTok um, when we came in July that you're not meant to roast it like this. You're meant to roast it in the sun. Maybe that's the proper way you're meant to do it, but this is like a speedy way to do it, I think. Yeah, I think there's different ways like coco or something oh but this one and my grandparents are very impatient very impatient so um this is the way our family does it and the cook is still so yummy it just tastes so different from the cook that we have in australia eh? fresh it just tastes fresh it's so good and it's so rewarding actually hey yeah doing it and then when you sit down to actually drink it it's like oh yummy <laughs> <laughs> so yes we will take you through on how we make coco in our family because i'm pretty sure everybody does it completely different but we make it the way we like to drink it and eat it <laughs> So my dad told us to get um, sand and um, to roast it with the sand so that um, it doesn't stick together. But when Esse comes, we'll see. What she yeah. says. She's the boss. <laughs> if Grandpa ends up coming out here, we'll end up doing it with the sand. I'm pretty sure that's how we did it last time, though. When we did it with Makangi's um, wife. Oh. She did it with sand. Oh, did she come? Yeah, she's the one that came and helped us before. We're like um, real island girls, eh, Jana? <laughs> yeah. Especially like we're here just doing it ourselves. We're pretty proud. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, because it's you don't do this stuff in Australia, you know? This is This is just island life. So it's pretty exciting for us because it's not the norm. But I think for the kids that live here, this is a, a boring chore that they have to do all the time. Especially when it's so hot. It's, you don't want to do anything in this heat. But swim. Hey? But swim. Yeah, you don't want to do anything but swim. Not good. You can probably peel up some. So, yeah, we've got. Oh, this is what the boys went and got earlier. You guys would have seen the boys went out there by themselves. So, what do I peel it all up? Or? Yeah, until it's like if it's too hard, then I don't think it's good. Uh, yeah, like, now. Nah. Yeah, so you guys would have seen the boys go out earlier to go get these cockles, um, which is literally in the backyard. Pretty cool. We're almost done, eh? Yeah. Will this make a lot? Um, you know the container with the yellow lid? Yeah. They'll probably make like the first few. Oh, yeah. Which is enough. So how long have you been in Sarge, Isla? 
I've been here two months. Two months. Yeah. And do you feel like you've learned a lot since being here? Yeah, I feel like I learned like I understand the language a lot more. Yeah. Because when I got here, I didn't know anything. I'm very plastic. <laughs> <laughs> and I understand like the whole Samoan way of things now. Yeah. A lot more better. Like, what's an example? Well, I didn't know anything. So, like, I didn't know you had to give a ipuki yeah. <laughs> to people who come visit. Yeah. Yeah. Like, you just have to be, it's very, like, old ways, like, traditional, you know? Yeah. Like, you have to be respectful. Yeah. You don't talk back. <laughs> <laughs> There's certain things that you can and cannot say to the oldies. Yeah. 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 Which is good. Yeah. I, I'm really proud of you for coming out here and, and living this life. Thanks. Especially on your own. Yeah. You know? Yeah. I think we're done. Oh, good job. Oh, we just will... kidding. Oh, she's a liar. <laughs> <laughs> I was poking all the wrong ones. Oh, this one's nice. Yeah, so I'm actually learning a bit from Jala too. Um, I think I've done Goko like six times while doing here. Oh, wow. Mm -mm. Let's show them what we've got so far. <laughs> like this? Yeah. Whoa. So that's what it looks like right now. And um, we probably have to try to build the fire now, eh? Mm-hmm. Wow. We'll get back to you guys. <laughs> Drop it? Yeah. All right. So Jyla and I just went and got Lou to come and start the fire for this us. This is how I saw her. Um, so that we can start roasting this. Uh, Vicoli. Vicoli. Uh, Vicoli, yeah. Do you have the... Um, I've got the lighter. <clears throat> lighter right here. Boss Jazz. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. We are just really determined to try and do this by ourselves. Hey, yeah. Jyla. Yeah. We want to try and learn how to do it so that we don't have to keep asking poor Asso Esse to drop what she's doing yeah. and come. Oh, wait. Lou wants us to record. Just, oh. <laughs> that's a lot. Okay. Relax. <laughs> oh. So this is what Lou learned earlier. Oh, we need a stick. Hey. Oh, like a lot. Yeah. This one, should we use these ones? Oh, I meant a stick for us. A stick oh, for us. Oh, for you guys to ask for the... Yeah. yeah. What, like one of these? Um, oh, there. That? I had a, I had oh. a stick here. I don't know where everything goes here. It just goes everywhere. It's really mean. I think we really need to clean this up a bit. Put some order into this place. So Jala's over there looking for a stick because we have to stir this stuff, I think. Oh. How do you release this thing? As you can tell, we're not smokers, so... <laughs> oh. You can hear the gas on that? Like stuck. Maybe you need to stay down low. Yeah. This should just flick and then flicker on, eh? <laughs> Amateurs. But hey, there's only one way to learn, eh, darling? Yeah, gotta, we've got to give it a crack. On. Sink or swim, mate. If you can't eat, well, then you've got a problem. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> what are you laughing at, Jala? My uncle's so funny. <laughs> Without even trying. <laughs> Some people don't realize. I've never seen anyone use a lighter like that. I've never seen <laughs> one. This was normal. No. I just want to get it started before your dad comes. What, Lou? I want to get it started before your dad comes. <laughs> he's gonna... Oh, he's watching Lou. Are you for him? Yep. Oh, he's about to get up. Are you joking right now? 
No, I'm not joking. He's actually sitting up now looking at you. Oh, shit. Oh, is it really? What the hell? And that's hot. Bruh. <laughs> you know what we so need? it looks like we're not eating today. <laughs> <laughs> we need someone oh, that knows how to use a lighter. <laughs> oh, good job. He fixed it. Oh, the old man's walking here now, Lou. Don't turn around. <laughs> Sexist now these days is it? trying to be a, a he she he. Aye. <laughs> you can't say that. Okay. Kind of, I'm trying to be a independent, independent person. Real island boy. Mm. But we're failing at the moment because we can't even start the fire. <laughs> Finally, oh, yeah. looks like oh, yeah. we're getting somewhere. <laughs> Lou is one determined ulupo <laughs> yeah. Aren't you, darling? Yeah. I'll block the wind. Wind blocker. Fire starter. I'm the camera woman. <laughs> we can do it. <laughs> Gotta do that. Would you choose this over mining, Lou? Yeah. Because mining, you have to like do a permit before you... You can't even start fires in mining. But before you can even do a job, you got to do so many paperwork and crap before you can do this. Look, got no safety boots, no safety glasses, no gloves. You just... So what's going to happen here because of a bit of wind? It's going to escalate the fire and it's going to build the fire up into something spectacular. <laughs> it's gonna be like fireworks. Hey, Jala. Yeah. Jala, say. What's that? Jala's going to look for something because she knows how to do this stuff. She's been here for two months. Oh, what do you cover the top here, Jala? This Oh, yeah. Yo. Good job, darling. Yay. Who's a local now? From Salon Longs. <laughs> From town. Watch out. You want to help the girl? <laughs> yeah, she's going to lean it on that. Good work. Good work, team. Should we put, it Should on? We put this on now? Yeah. Maybe a good idea. Nice. Yeah. Who said we couldn't do it, eh? I saw SA must be really busy. Why? Did your mum call? No, the boys walked over. Oh, together? Still? Yeah. Mm. Oh, so she's probably trying to do her own stuff at home. Okay, so this the is just the fire's going. The this is the koko. This is the second second step, you reckon? So they peeled it. And this is... Well, I've never seen it. You should see it. Okay. Oh. Yeah, there's one thing. Oh, it's your phone. Oh, it's just yeah. Putting some sand over that. Oh, that's strong. Do you want to move that one now? Yeah, okay. Move that one, please. Yeah. Okay, you want to move it? I've got a dollar. Oh. Right. Oh. That got hot real fast. Mm -hmm. 
You're the You're the local Quebec girls here, Jaila. Yeah, mate. It is. Alright. What are you doing here? What's this called? We think it's fat the cocoa. <laughs> We're roasting it. Yeah. Roasting it, yeah. Roasting it. Get that fire going, get it burning. Getting nice there. Yeah. And the sand apparently helps it to not stick together. Oh, not the cocoa stick together? Yeah. Okay. I don't know. Is it, does it usually look like this color? Um, We have no idea what we're doing. We're trying to do what little bits and pieces that we've seen um, get Asa done. Ese do and yeah, and also Mugani's wife. I can't remember her name. And yeah, when when we said that we're going to see how that sticks, I think that's what it means. Oh, not stick to the to the tin, maybe. Yeah. Yeah. Now, I'm pretty sure she put it on. It's just easier like that. <laughs> so we've got the professionals here now. The professionals have come to help. And they already told us that we did something wrong. You know what we did wrong, did I? No. We built it up too high. So now the fire is burning our legs while we're trying to do this. <laughs> So next time we know we need to fill it low, but it's our first time, so live and learn. We'll come back to you, we're closer to when we have to start wow 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 the cocoa. <laughs> This is how you make a... Kopai. Kopai. Do you want to go for it? Do you want to go for it? Nutella! Where do you have? has got Nutella and bread. They've got all the yeah, balls that were inside the gopai. Dad's well, eating his gopai too. Yeah. Now, I've got gopai. Nearly ready. In the next episode of Life of a FIFO family, join us as we catch the bus from Kua Bax to Apia and back again. Don't forget to like, comment, share and subscribe.